What are performance royalties? In our previous video, we talked about music publishing and we mentioned performance royalties. We highly recommend that you check that one out first. To start thinking about music in legal terms, it is important to realize that there are two types of musicians, songwriters or composers and performance artists. These two types of musicians hold two distinct copyrights. Songwriters hold the rights to the lyrics and melody of a piece of music. Performing artists hold the rights to a particular recording of a song, which is called a master recording. And yes, a songwriter can be the performing artist of her song too. Tracking a song's use and obtaining payment for the various kinds of uses can be an arduous task. So, songwriters and recording artists typically assign their rights to a third party for management. Song copyrights, for the lyrics and melody, are assigned to music publishers, while master recording rights are assigned to a record label. So, what are performance royalties? A performance royalty is owed to the songwriter and publisher of a particular song whenever that composition is broadcast or performed in public. Performance royalties are also generated when songs are played on jukeboxes in cafes, restaurants, karaoke bars, supermarkets, doctor's waiting rooms, etc. Basically, if you hear music when you're out, it's generating cash for the people who wrote it. Anyone that wants to play music within their business has to pay for a license in order to do so. Performance rights organizations collect license fees from music users by issuing licenses and then pay songwriters and publishers in the form of performance royalties for any performance of their composition, regardless of who performed it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel